Hey guys, here's a quick tutorial on how to get through Ninja Castle. First you're going to want to hit the dimensional mirror and then go to Mushroom Shrine. Then you're going to want to talk to Perry and click Ninja Castle. Once you enter, there will be five different corridors, each with their own riddle. There are five possible riddles per corridor and you'll have to find the correct hidden portal to enter based on the riddle. In the description, I will be linking Rexr2's Google Doc for this, which shows all of the riddles, their respective corridor, and the solution. Also, there will be timestamps in the comments and in the description for each of the riddle solutions for each respected corridor. Alright, it's time for the first corridor. Alright, time for the second corridor, which has the exact same name as the first corridor. Alright, Corridor 3, the Identity Corridor. Corridor 4, the Of Corridor. And finally, the fifth corridor, the Dymo corridor. So once you clear all five corridors, you will spawn in a map with three doors and a few mobs. The mobs you see on the map determine what floor you're on. The ordering of the floors is the blue ninja, the red haired ninja, the white haired ninja, the black haired ninja, the bald ninja, the red armor ninja, and the girl ninja. So there are seven total floors. Each door on the map has a random function. It will either send you up to the next floor, send you down a floor, or send you to the first floor. So you should mark which door leads you up a floor. For example, I type 1, 2, or 3, depending on which door leads me to the next floor, where 1 is the left door, 2 is the middle door, and 3 is the right door. Once you clear all seven floors, you'll be sent to False Dymo. If you clear the castle within 10 minutes, you'll be able to face Frenzy Gigatoad. If it takes you longer than 10 minutes, you'll only face regular Gigatoad. You can enter the castle three times a day. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.